Hi, with what's going on with the coronavirus, it's quite a um, uncertain time. There's a lot of anxieties going around. I know people are quite struggling with the WW plans at the moment, um, struggling to get food. I know that quite a few people from some of the posts that I've seen on some social media are struggling to get hold of things like chicken breast, turkey breast, um, obviously pastas re um, going. So I just wanted to do a quick video to say what I plan to do. I do plan to stay on plan as much as possible. Obviously it's extremely, extremely stressful situation and people are going to have blips bingy people are going to go totally off plan and it's going to be whatever helps you but for me it's not going to help me to eat i can put a lot of weight on very very quickly i've lost over 250 pounds altogether and i can put an awful lot of weight on very very quickly um, and i don't intend that to happen because that's not going to help my well-being it's not going to help with my anxieties and the stress of the situation so for me i need to keep on plan as much as possible um i currently follow the green plan i have followed the blue plan when it was flex freestyle but i've followed um the ww no count plan before now obviously that's not supported at the moment it is kind of similar to the purple plan but it's not there are a lot more zero pointed foods with no count um if you look at some of my what i eat in a day videos on the green plan i pretty much eat what i want anyway so i can sort of adapt what i eat to make it lower in points so that i can sort of eat what i want that's the beauty of the green plan for me however worst case scenario and if the worst comes to the worst i won't switch to blue because it doesn't suit me at all um, and I won't switch to purple because obviously also the problem with chicken breast being quite scarce and also turkey breast being quite scarce I do eat quite a lot of meat um, so what I intend to do worst case scenario is I'll switch back to the old dough count plan um, like I said, WW don't support that. I do have a friend that has a website which explains what no count is and also has a list of the um, zero pointed foods that are, well, they are free foods on no count. That's what they were called, free foods. I will put the link underneath the video. It's called Loving No Count, so if you want to Google it, you can, but I will pop the link underneath. Um, the thing with no count is it gives me a lot more freedom. I do have no count foods in. Some of them are quite similar to the purple plan and the blue plan, but it, I do have a little bit more leeway where the uh, no count's concerned. Things like lean, all lean meats are zero pointed on no count. So it's things like I've got pork in the freezer, I've got 5% pork, um, I've got beef. So all of those are zero pointed. So there are go-tos that I can have. Um, baked beans are zero pointed on no count. Um, crumpets are zero pointed. I've still got quite a few in the freezer. Um, when I was out yesterday, there were still crumpets around. So there are still bits and pieces that I can eat and that I can still get when I'm about. Um, meat, there was quite a lot of chicken thighs around yesterday. Um, there was some mince and stuff. So. I can um, still stick to pl a plan. It's not one of the WW plans, um, current plans, but I can still t stick to a plan. Um, I can maintain on no count and I can also lose on no count. Um, you still get your weeklies, so I've still got room to maneuver and I can still have treats if I want. Um, when I first started my YouTube channel, sort of six months ago, I was following the no count plan so um what i'll do is i'll pop a playlist on with no count um called no count so i'll put what i'll do is i'll put that those things into that playlist so i've got some recipes and i've got some what i eat in a day on no count so if you want to go and have a look you can do like i said helen's website is brilliant she's got recipes on there and she's also got all of the free foods that are on no count and she'll explain it she explains it as well so um if the worst case scenario comes along you want to stick on plan but you you're struggling green plans an option because if you look at what i eat in a day i pretty much do eat what i want um but like i said worst case scenario you can always flick to the old no count plan 
it's not ideal but um, stressful times um, call for uh, changing your perspective basically um, like I said I have no intention of putting a load of weight on during this crisis it's not going to help me it's not going to help my mental health currently my gym is still open when I was losing weight I didn't exercise however for the past two years exercise has been quite a big part of my routine I am concerned that when it shuts that it may knock me off plan but I am currently waiting for my WW wellness wins to come it said 14 days 17 days ago so I'm still waiting for that but I'm going to give yoga a try there are loads of free yoga um, videos on YouTube so if my gym shuts I'm gonna flick to yoga basically that's what I'm going to do to try and just give myself a little bit of exercise every day um, and just try and keep myself ticking over like I said it's not ideal it's not the ideal situation we're all under a huge amount of stress and anxiety but it's how we deal with that stress and anxiety I know the urge to binge eat is quite significant for quite a lot of people however the way that I see it is it's not going to help the situation it's not going to make the situation any better um, where I'm concerned I need to look after me as well I can't look after other people if I'm not well and if if I'm not in that right place it's a stressful time but um, I need to eat well for me I need to do a bit of exercise for me so that's what I'll continue to do I hope everybody's well um, I know it's not the best situation please look after yourself thank you for tuning in goodbye <laughs>